traveling to Dubai with updated rules and guidelines for travel from Angora, Cote d'Ivoire, Indonesia and Vietnam. Hi guys, welcome back to this channel and if it's your first time to come across this channel, please consider subscribing. Don't forget to click the bell icon, it will be the only way you'll be updated as long as as soon as we load a new video or as soon as we upload a new video. For the returning subscribers, thank you so much for coming back to this channel. For the new subscribers, thank you so much for coming back to this channel. We are looking at, we are still looking at traveling to Dubai and we are looking at the updated travel guidelines. We are looking at the updated travel guidelines for travelers from Angora, uh, Cote d'Ivoire, Indonesia and Vietnam. Remember, passengers traveling to Dubai from Angola, Cote d'Ivoire, Indonesia and Vietnam must present a negative PCR test results for the COVID-19 test done in not more than 72 hours. So if you are coming from these two from these countries, Cote d'Ivoire, you are coming from Angora, you are coming from Indonesia, you are coming from Vietnam. One of the requirements you should present if you should present a negative PCR test before you depart or before your, your, your departure from your original country. You should present one from the approved facilities by your government and should have been taken in what you call the last 72 hours of your departure. The certificate should also contain the QR codes. Remember, remember, still travelers from the same countries, still travelers from these mentioned countries, the Angola, Cote d'Ivoire, Indonesia, and Vietnam, will need will need to take will need to take another pcr test on arrival at the dubai international airport so on your arrival at dubai international airport then you will need to take another pcr testing hope this is very clear however to a few exemptions from those groups Still, children of 12 years of age are still exempted. And also, people with moderate or severe disabilities still under the same category are exempted from taking the PCR test. However, something that needs to be emphasized or stressed is that the negative PCR test must have been taken in the last 72 hours. Hope I've tried to share something with you. Thank you so much for coming back to this channel and thank you so much for subscribing to this channel. It's Max from the Max Creation Team. See you again in the next video.